well, there's lots of people in the world who've done really important and really interesting things. You have people like Thomas Edison, who's perfected uh, the modern light bulb. Uh, and you have people like uh, political figures like Martin Luther King Jr., who have fought for justice and equality for other people. Uh, you have other inventors like Wilbur and Orville Wright who, inve who invented the airplane. Uh, just the list goes on and on and on. But each of these people all have countless books written about them. Uh, their early life, about their childhood, uh, maybe where they went to school, how their school influenced them. Uh, maybe things that happened to them when they were in college or when they were studying somewhere or working somewhere. Uh, all these things that led to what they ultimately accomplished. And all these things they did well how they were uh, focusing on their craft, whether it was Martin Luther King Jr. Uh, leading marches or sit-ins or protests or uh, Thomas Edison, all the failures that it took to get to the light bulb or the Wright brothers perfecting uh, their engines and their bicycle shop. All of these things uh, have, uh, record, all these books record what happened to them. And there's a verse that I love in John 21. And John 21 verse 25 says, now, there are also many other things that Jesus did, were every one of them to be written. I suppose that the world itself could not contain the books that would be written. John makes an observation that the amount of things that Jesus did while he was on earth were so incomprehensible that the amount of pages that would be needed to record all of them wouldn't be able to fit in the entire world. There's things that we don't even know about that Jesus did, that weren't recorded, uh, that weren't written down, that were just witnessed by people. And so if we're amazed by what Jesus did that we have recorded in the Bible, how much more will we be amazed when we get to heaven and we hear about all the things that weren't written in the Bible? But all the countless people that were healed or that were made to be uh, have sight again instead of being blind. Or people that followed Jesus because he taught them something that they realized they needed. All these things that Jesus did that weren't recorded, uh, I, you can only imagine what they are. But what we know is that they are miracles upon miracles upon miracles and teachings about the kingdom of God and about who Jesus was. And so if we just scratch the surface with what's in the Bible, there's so much more that we can just only imagine. And it's going to be great to hear one day when we get to heaven.